Miss Hope Moneybags. Mr. PC Dim. Uh, it, it's just PC Dim, actually. Oh, yes, of course. Sorry. Uh, are you aware that we have a recorded confession of yours? I don't understand. On the morning of August the 27th, you said this. I was thinking of us, Penelope. That seems to be a fairly conclusive admission of guilt. No, no, no. Mr. PC Dim, you've misunderstood. I was letting Penelope know that I wasn't just thinking of her. I was thinking of us. The two of us. Together. At last. But you told Inspector Norse that Sir Hoggett didn't like it and you weren't supposed to be in contact with her. Was that when you decided to kill him? No, I didn't. I wouldn't. I mean, I have thought of it, but I'd never actually do it. Mm. I had made a decision, but not to kill Hoggett. I had decided to be brave and independent. I see. It took me 25 years to build up the courage, but you have to think these things through, you know. I was going to strike out on my own. And what were you going to do? You'd go and live with Penelope. I've been saving up money from my allowance for the plane fare. Hmm. Now, because of the will, I won't have any allowance anymore. Unless I stay single. Well, I wouldn't worry about that well too much, miss. What do you mean? Oh, eh, 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 nothing, 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 nothing. Now, I do have one last question for you, and this is very important. Now, you told Inspector Norse that you weren't really listening at the dinner table on the day of Sir Hoggett's death. Now, I need you to think long and hard about the argument between Camera and Jonty. Try and remember. What were they arguing about? Oh, yes, of course. I told you there was something fishy about her. Well, I'm not sure. Oh, yes, that was it. I had asked what they were doing after the wedding mm. and Camara said that they hadn't decided yet. Uh, and then she pointed out of the window and said something like, um, but what could be more beautiful than here? You, you know, the way she does. Um, and then Jonty got very cross and he mm. said, oh yes, he said, she could stay here if she wanted to, but she needn't think that he was going to settle down with a load of old codgers. I think perhaps he meant me. Anyway, that was it. Well, thank you, Miss Moneybags. That was very helpful. <laughs> oh, Mr. Dim, when will we be allowed to leave our rooms? Very soon, Miss Moneybags. Very soon indeed. <laughs>